waiting for. That's what it's all about. This silly season has been pretty nuts. I know, Stuerhaus is shutting down, other teams are buying chargers, and drivers moving to different places. Dog, I don't know about y'all, but I'm ready to dip after this season. So in case if I don't see y'all again, it was nice knowing you. Well, I'm heading over to the Gibbs to replace Martin. Also kind of funny I'll be racing for my hero's old team before starting this one. I'm replacing Burton. Aww. So where do I go now? Back from the dead, beaches! Oh, and I'm taking your number, Ryan. With the opportunity to compete for Spire in the 71 next year is truly a blessing from the Lord. Hey, Bob, you think you got an extra seat? You're driving it, you big dummy. Well, at least we don't have to worry about our contracts. Yeah, true. Hey, Corey, remember about the multi-year contract extension? Uh, yeah? Well, yoink. I didn't know how to say it directly towards you, so I put down an Uno reverse card. See ya. Corey? You okay, buddy? Brad, what are you doing? I'm mixing Mountain Dew and orange juice together. Ugh, that's disgusting. Have you tried it before? No, but I can tell you that does not go together. Whoa, who are you to judge if you never tried it before? Let me explore my curiosity. Okay, and why exactly are you doing this? You know how people mix his Jack Daniels and Coke together? Well, I'm doing that except with Mountain Dew and orange juice. Fine. Fine, whatever floats your boat. Oh, and if I do die, in events I already persuaded Jack Roush to rename the team to Roush Fenway Busher, RFB. Well, how does it taste? It tastes like Fanta. Okay, so no side effects? Nope, tastes like Fanta. Okay, I'm gonna try to see what ham and milk tastes like together, cause I'm a bit hungry. Well, that was more anticlimactic than the finish of the brickyard. One more time around! And the 41 still isn't moving. And I don't see any way NASCAR late some race by this. And there's the caution! Larson's gonna do it! <laughs> <laughs> don't understand. How am I not getting the results I need? I'm like 17 points above the cut line and the playoffs aren't getting any further away. Gee, tell me how you really feel. Shut up! No one asked your opinion. Okay, f- Woo! Trackhouse is on fire this season. I feel like that's a bit of an overstatement, but technically, I'm racing for colleague. But the car I'm driving for for them has an alliance for this team, so you're kind of right on that one. Ah, <sighs> well if it isn't all my fellow teammates that have a win over me. Heros, I know it's been stressful for you lately. Nah, no, it's because it's this late in the season where I don't have a win, while you had your lucky win a while back in March, and Shane keeps winning on every road course he goes to in the lower series. If I would add, I've been getting better on the ovals. I know where you're coming from, man, because I was in the same boat as you last year. And like you said, even if I don't win now, there's still races left of the season to win. Yeah. I mean, everyone thinks I'm this absolute giga chat of a driver in this world, but I wasn't always like this when I was racing in supercars. Really, it was my last seven years in the sport I teared up the record books. What I'm trying to say here is the timing will be right when it's your time to shine. You know what? You're right, guys. Even when I'm under immense amount of pressure, I'll be able to find my way through it. I've done it once and I can do it again. After all, this is Team Trackhouse. Yeah, now that's the spirit. Now let's get going to Richmond. Where is he? It's been 10 minutes already. I know. We gotta get on the road to practice for next race. Hey, right, sorry about the wait, guys. Ran in the traffic on 85. What is it that you want to show us? Last night I discovered an interesting power I can use on anyone. What? You can use powers? Well, to a certain extent. I want to show you guys since obviously you're my favorite drivers. <sighs> Alright then, just make it quick. And this better not be cringe! 
It's not that cringe. You'll see. Andrew fan, what the freak? Bro, why am I built like this? Hey, at least I gained a few yards taller. Why are we still here? Just to suffer. Every night, I can feel my leg and my arm, even my fingers. Well, what do y'all think? Your powers to turn us into marketable plushies? Please change me back. I gotta go to I-55 Speedway in a few hours. Uh. What? You can't turn us back? Uh. What Dude, the you can't. What the heck? Funny man. You want to turn us trouble we're in right now? Okay, look, look, look. I think if we all just take a couple of deep breaths here and just try to. Come here, boy. <laughs> Let's go, I win. Fart. We got him! Kyle, Chase, help us circle him! We are going to beat you to death. Oh no. Uh oh, look, an airplane. Wait a minute, we're <laughs> Dang it, we lost him. Well, I guess we're stuck like this for a while. Not unless we find Hendrick fan. If we do, we'll be back to normal in no time. I can't feel my face. It's official, boys. 2024 is my last full time season. Hey, you had a great career, man. Better than what I could have achieved. Thanks, Billy. So soon I'll be joining you in chicken retirement. Hey, welcome to the club. So I guess after that, all we have left to cheer for is Brad. Yay! This is going to be more fun than the time I took Hendrick Fane's phone and accidentally joined the stream yard. Here's something I found recently presented by Earth, 20, Earth 50 William Byron. What? It's a monkey! Funky. <laughs> That's me! <laughs> monkey. Where's the spinning monkeys at? <laughs> What? <laughs> okay, you ready? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Here it comes. Okay, okay, I'm ready. Boom, boom. Let's all go to court. Boom, boom. Let's go make some law now. Yeah, 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 some law. Bow. I say we go to court. Yes, let's go to court. We're a bunch of who take up a whole hallway with our conversation. Hey, you lawyer guys, you don't know me and Johnny are watching you while we're high. That was f***ing That magic. felt smooth. That felt oh. really smooth. So in the pocket. Oh. Don't do that. Here's the thing, though. Here's the. Hold on. I only rowdy. Only only rowdy people understand. <laughs> what the hell? Where's my son? Oh, here's here. Um, Where's okay, my son? One second. Help me find my son. <laughs> hey, Help me find right. my son. Yeah. Help right. me, please. Uh, 
Get Wait, for one Nemo, minute. where are yeah. you? Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> Help me find my son! <laughs> Help me what find just my son! Not flying. What does he look like? Yo, yo, Marlin, chill! Help me find my son! I think he's been eaten. <laughs> yeah. What does he look like? <laughs> let me explain, let me explain what happened. Let me explain what happened. So, so he was attacked by multiple fish after they were not fed in five days. No, no. my son! <laughs> no. no, I think the one that killed him. I think the one that killed your son was uh, the puffer fish. No, no, no. Airborne, you got it all wrong. You got it all wrong. You want to know who really killed your son? <laughs> Bruce. No, not Bruce. Bruce. <laughs> 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 that dang shark. He killed my son. I'll <laughs> kill the shark. Hold up. Dead. Hold up. Hold up. What if, what if Nemo was cooking by a human and cooked? <laughs> He's still <so> alive. <laughs> my son is alive. <laughs> No, I'm fine. No. I'm fine. Fortunately, he was found fine. dead with Shot. nothing left of him but his bones. He ate my son. I know where your son is. I know where Somehow I was able to keep my cool this whole entire time. So, by the way, Hey, congrats on the win, Austin. Let's go! My boy's playoff bound. Hey, thanks, guys. So, anything you want to do for your celebration? Let's go down to the improv and yell sad suggestions? Uh, maybe not today. Hey, how about we play some golf? Hmm, I'm not sure. I'm not the best at golfing. Ah, don't worry about it, Austin. Come on, it'll be fun. And boring. And hot to the point where you're burning the curse like it's Sonoma. All right, you got me hooked. I'm in. Okay, now I regret going golfing after everything I just listed. Hey, bro, why is the... How come Austin chose that one to putt? All right, guys, I'm about to send this one out of the park. Whoa! Oh, shoot, he's bleeding. Wait, actually? Yeah, let's go check on him. Austin, are you alright? I think so. How do I look? Hey, at least all of your teeth, which we can't physically see since we're all metal toy cars, are still in one piece. Hey, y'all mind if I take a quick picture? Yeah, sure. And then he posted that picture on Instagram. Ugh, <sighs> we've been driving for an hour and a half and we still have no idea where we are. Hey, what's behind that door? I think I hear music playing. Yeah, same. Wow, I can't believe you guys left me at that 7-Eleven back there. Oop, sorry, gave me time, Eleven. Anyway, so what's going on here? Well, we found a door with the lights on. I see. Should we go in? No. Okay, then. No, I mean, no, as in yes, but, uh, you see... In the Polish language, no, it's, uh... Ah, screw it, let's just go inside.
Oh, yeah. I know exactly where we are. Man, I wish I was a part of that. We deserve respect. Ted, shut up. Fine. A beautiful sunny day. Oh my god. What happened to the sun? <gasps> Easy, white chocolate. I wouldn't want you to melt. <laughs> <laughs> ah, this movie is so good, it's so hysterical. I know. I wish Chase was able to hang out and watch the movie with us. This is so funny. It's been a long day without you, my friend, and I'll tell you all about it when... Hey guys, look what I found. Egg? Hey, look who made it. It's Justin to complete the 2019 College Dream Team. So how's it going over there at Rick Ware Racing? I mean, it's good. The only thing I don't like is when I run into Cody. <gasps> what the f I can explain. Hey Billy, check out this thing I found. See ya! Ha <laughs> ha! Why do I still love friends? Hey, thanks for inviting me to hang out with y'all. Oh, uh, it's no problem. Hey, why don't we wait for a food? Let's play Would You Rather. I used to play that all the time with Brad. Hmm, sounds like a good idea to pass the time. I got one. Would you rather work together with your teammate to both score points, but he ends up winning? Or be stuck in the back all day but finish in the top 15 at Talladega Super Speedway? Gee, that's a good question. Earning points throughout the race, but I wouldn't know where I would finish. The worst I can finish is dead last. But if I have a clean race, not score any stage points in which I think you're referring to, but finish in the top 15, could be anywhere from 15th to 1st. I'd have to go with that option. In the back all day, but in the end finishing in the top 15. All right, Daniel, I got one for you. Would you rather live in a very dirty mansion or in a small but clean apartment? Bro, the mansion, obviously. I ain't an ant. Plus, I could clean or hire someone to take care of the house for me. All right, let me give you one. Would you rather have a good race for once or keep wrecking yourself to make life harder for everyone? One, I will burn your house down in your Minecraft server. And two, who are you to talk when you're below the top 30 in points? Oh, really? Talk to me when you have a championship, buddy. Um, actually, I have two of them compared to your one, and they were back to back. All right, all right, just settle down. I know you two are hungry. Let's just continue the game until the food arrives. I got one for you, Hendrick fan. Would you rather keep NASCAR Cup crazy just the same, or have a grand intro? Hmm. My name is Hendrick Fan, and I am just a man who makes unhinged videos with various audio. There's characters both old and new that are random, so beware. Through rare times or cringe times, it's the moments that we share. Get ready and spread your wings for all the hastiness. Gonna fly and say some things. This is National Cup craziness. Yahoo! Nah, keep it the same. Oh. Boy, my God, I found <laughs> Yeah, dude. I think it's these smooth-tasting drinks that found us. Yeah. Uh, hey, hey, Brad. I got a question. Yeah? Would you rather win a championship or a Daytona 500? I think they... Well, but you have to choose one, not 
Ball. Yeah, one of both. So we have one Daytona 500 and another championship trophy. Wanna know why? I'm me. I'm him. Wait, why would you bet a cheat one of them? Ah, I, I would pick the championship. Why that? Because anytime I think sad to myself of not having both, I'll pour down a six pack in that cup trophy where the bulb's on the top and drink that puppy up like. By the time I would have eight championships and five Daytona 500s without the racing, I would be more superior than the king himself. Man, we didn't think of that. Cause you're drunk. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> hey, look, it's me from the last year. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, what do you guys think of the Hendrick drivers getting turned into plushies? Good! I hate them! Always screwing me out of a win and so mean! Now I can win a race without them being in my way! At this point, I don't bother to give two craps. I'm ready for Chase to take over my ride and add personality to the team. You weren't supposed to hear that until later. Well, with the Hendrick boys gone, I wonder if Hendrick fan's gonna rename himself to Gibbs Fan 24 7. No! No! Mm -mm. Mm -mm. No, 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 hell no, 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 I refuse, no, no. Good evening, welcome to Earth 24. Hey, I was just about to say that. Anyways, we're going to ask you to please show us your IDs and a quick security scan. See, Randy, we totally got this. Oh my gosh, John, I've told you, this is not a competition. Uh, what is happening? I don't know. I've never seen these people when I first arrived here. That's alright, miss. It's just a security checkpoint. Dude, I was just about to say that. That's for saying my greeting line when those two arrive. Now we're even. Uh... Double J's, it's not that big of a deal. Those two are clean. Let them through. You got a brother? Are they always that competitive? Yeah, I mean, they've always been that way ever since they were friends. Hello, sir. No need to call me sir and make a movie, just Donald. How are y'all doing? We're doing good. Me and Jay were wondering where Hendrick Fan is. Well, I'm right here. Hey, Hendrick Fan. What's up, Polish machine? I can't complain, living the dream. By the way, H, who were those Carpatolas? I don't think I've seen them before. Oh, they didn't introduce themselves? Where are you guys' manners? Make a movie, J-dubs, this is Arthur. He's a communications guy who detects messages, signals, warnings, or danger reports back here. The guy in the blue Camaro back there is John, and the white Mustang next to him is Jonathan. Hello! As you can tell, they are pretty competitive. Arthur told me they've been that way ever since they were friends as kids, but they make a good addition to the team in keeping the place running in the right direction. And yes, they do essentially have the same name, so we call them Double J's for short. Behind them is Randy. He's pretty calm for the most part, and is one of Thompson's regional buddies. And this guy next to me is Colton. He's a mechanical engineer who makes sure we are loaded with reliable parts and pieces for the mission, and of course, speed. Ooh. I know, right? So, the replacements of the older members of the Carpatolas? Nah, man, you still got the OGs. Why well, recently got a raise in promotion for our duty in protecting the land and securing the leadership role for Hendrick Fan. We ain't going nowhere. How did you meet the new recruits? Well, that's actually an interesting story. Care to share, Donald? Sure thing. Don't worry, honey. I got the mail. Oh, great. It's here. That mirror I bought on eBay. Oh, my God. <laughs> Dang, John, you just took out that three car. There was nothing I could do. The car just kept flooring it. Oh my goodness, both cars took a lot of damage. At least it wasn't Colton that was controlling this with the way he drives. Hey, don't bring me this conversation with yours. Guys, it's actually somewhat of a good thing that John stopped that three car, because if he didn't, that Dodge Challenger back there would have been shredded to pieces. Huh. I'm not sure about what I'm saying would be true, but I think what you do is right, John. Excuse me, gentlemen. I don't know who you five are, but I can't thank you enough. If you haven't stopped that abnormally large black car that was chasing me, 
Lord knows I would have come home to him. We're all glad that you're still in good condition after that. My name is Arthur. The Camaro is John. The Mustang is Jonathan. The other red car is Randy. And back there is Colton. We were having trouble to find the place for the new recruitment for military. Do you happen to know where we could find directions for that place? It's standing right in front of you. Johnny has 19 bottles of this soap, and he gets Gina. Wait, why does Johnny have so many soaps? Mind your business, Dave! You hear Logano pushing El Morona right up into the ass end of Keselowski, and he turns his ass right into the wall. Right about here, Keselowski saying, oh, 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 every time he's spinning, he's saying, oh, they are wrecking every where there's race cars pouring from here to China right now on this track. And this is where it starts, right here, Logano pushing El Morona into Keselowski's ass, pushing way too damn hard. The race has still got a bunch of laps left. What an asshole! And then it's just a mangled melee mess right here. Holy This is some bull All these good race cars tore up because Logano forgot how to drive. Look at this And he escapes uninjured. Watch. He's just gonna go right through there. Holy s***! How goes the mission, Snake? Colonel, I just saw Venom hit the gritty before getting shot in the head by son Goku. Can I go home, please? That's a negative, Snake. You're the only soldier we have who has any chance of getting a victory crown. Colonel, Mr. Beast has just killed the Duke's man with a fucking golf cart. Welcome to the NASCAR News. Your host, Glance. Good evening, NASCAR fans. In tonight's news, we'll be talking about contracts and folks heading to new places. Before we dive into those subjects, I'd like to welcome a special guest to the show. So everyone, please welcome my fellow Fox broadcaster and former racing teammate, Kevin Harvick. Well, thank you for having me on tonight's edition of The NASCAR News, Clint. Can't wait to talk about what's happening out in the world of NASCAR. First off, we have the extended contracts with Eric Jones and Dino Suarez for their respective teams, Legacy Motor Club and Track House Racing. Although Suarez made an interesting quote in saying that things can change tomorrow in their contracts, and that Trackhouse has a bit of a downside in their performance with this year, with one driver in the playoffs, and the other trying to make it in on points. Saying for Suarez, we have a lot of work to do. Yeah, Team Trackhouse has been a bit off in terms of their performances in their cup program, and I understand where Daniel is coming from. He's competitive and I like that about him. He never gives up and is always looking to improve as a driver and for his team. Like the spark in the fire for something big that's about to come soon. Okay? Next topic we have is the vacancy of the 7 car for Spire Motorsports with the joy being out of a ride. Who would you say would be the best candidate to pilot that ride? Well, Clint, I'm not entirely sure on that yet, but I Wait, have what? heard rumors of a potential oh. team merge with Sorry Andretti Sorry to cut Motors you off, Kevin, but we have received breaking news from NASCAR that Austin Dillon's win at Richmond Raceway will not count for a spot in the playoffs. <laughs> what the f***? Guys, I'm bored. We should do something instead of just sitting around. Oh, I know. How about we play King of the Hill? You know what, I'm in. I love me some King of the Hill. I would definitely destroy you all in that game. Are you sure about that, Kyle? Because my last name's in the game, so I am guaranteed the win. Why don't you want to know why you're wrong? Because I'm KFB. All right. I'll bet you 50 bucks I'll last longer than you. 50 bucks? Are you sure about that? Oh, yeah, I am. It's a deal. Three, two, one, go! Yeah! Ah! Oh. Oh, that hurts. Uh, I can't feel my tires. I can't feel my tires. And that's why you should not make bets unless you're absolutely sure you are going to win. Take it from Lucas. He once made a bet at the Charlotte Motor Speedway drag ray of winning a race. Turned out he lost not only $70 from his pocket, but his engine power and ending up having to get towed back home. Yeah, that was a really bad day for me. You've got to be in the mood. Oh no.
why are we stopping in the middle of an interstate-like road? Woo! I haven't been this far out west in a long time. Man, this is refreshing. Well, yeah, that's one of the beauties of the west. But it's so tiring. Dude, it's incredibly hot for no reason. And it's the evening. I really don't feel like driving any further. It feels like I'm going to have a flat tire. I hear you, brother. Hey, there's a nice rest stop we can stay at for the night. Oh, yeah. Let's head inside and call it a day of driving. I hope they have some beef jerky in there. Ah, this is pretty relaxing. You don't say. At any moment, it feels like coming good on. Hey, y'all, look who fell asleep first. No, Gus. Oh, okay. So, how has it been going on in the multiverse as of recently? Pretty intense, if I'm being honest. Like, the Blood Moon Cult rising in 2025, and the return of the Dark of 17. Jeez, that must be exhausting having to deal with all that stress. Yeah, that's kind of why me and you stepped down from the whole drama. So now with my most recent stuff I have in my collection, I've got the throwback cars of Ross and Sheldon Creed, though I've been trying to find Williams. Hopefully I will. Wow, that's a big collection. That's pretty impressive. My guy sounds like he's been collecting for 20 years! Yeah, I know I got a lot. That's dedication and a half! <sighs> But I still don't get an idea why Deku's... My goodness, bless you, Airborne. I'm sorry, y'all, I had something tickling my nose. You're all right, Airborne. Hey, guys, what are you all up to? Oh, what's up, Hendrick fan? Hi, Hendrick fan. Uh, Solomon was just talking about an anime character whose movesets are apparently named after some U.S. states. They're called Quirks. Ah, okay. Hey, you should definitely join us in the conversation. Yeah, dude, come on in. Oh, thanks, guys. Zosavium Shivone Miese. Jinkuya. What? He was saying he left me an open seat. Oh. I'm surprised y'all ain't tired from the eight hour drive we all took. Oh, I'm tired, trust me. I mean, we all are, but we didn't really lead the pack as much as you did. Yeah. Like, look at these guys back there. They were a mid pack pretty much all day and aren't showing any fatigue. I love this new paint job. I know, Ivan. That looks awesome. Yeah, the design looks really good. Eh, uh, you can thank Gacha for this, but uh, he's uh, been on his phone. You guys know what the Wi-Fi password is so I can catch some Pokemon? I don't, sorry. Oh, don't worry about it. It's free to all guests. Oh. oh. Well, I think I'm going to hit the hay. No, 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 no. Hey, guys. Oh, hey, Mickey Movie. Yo, Jay said she's out cold from the driving. She said she didn't understand how we could handle that much of driving in a day. Well, I guess we're built differently. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but nah, I like driving. I find it pretty enjoyable. It's like my therapy, traveling to see what the world is like, seeing the beauty of the countryside. I can kind of agree with that. I can too. I guess anyone who's a fan of motorsports can too. Well, sorry to cut away from conversation, but I'm really feeling the need to rest my good years. Alright, no worries, H. Good night, Hendrick fan. The Bronos. What? He said good night. Oh, oh yeah, I knew that. Anyone wants an Arizona iced tea? Hey, right, you're good at this. Thanks. I play some Call of Duty in my spare time. Patrick fan. Oh, Patrick? Hey, what are you guys doing here? We're on a side mission in the West, and this is Randy's first one. This is nothing like the Northeast, Thompson. You'll get used to the different climates, bud. But seriously, we've got something important. Okay, what is it? I don't know if this thing came from New Mexico, but there are four large human objects approaching the rest stop. Patrick, I swear to God. Fart! What? Huh? We caught Uranus now, boy! Wait, what's going on here? Long story. I know you have that kind of power to turn us back. And we'll make you do that, if that's the last thing we do. What? Powers? All right, all right. I think I know how to turn you all back in the diecast form. You better. Well, this is going to be interesting. Okay. Okay, here we go. 
Ew. Oh my gosh, I can feel my tires again! Oh yeah, baby! Welcome back, me. Thank goodness this worked. This calls for a celebration! Party at Alex's house! What? Well, why me? Because you're the closest one from here. Oh, that's fair. What did I just witness? Eh, that kind of stuff is pretty common back at my place. Hey everyone, thank you for watching NASCAR Cup Craziness 27. As you can see, I'm preparing to hit the road soon. So I'll make it quick as y'all take a drive with me. All good to go, Sawyer. Alright, 13, here I come. My summer's coming to an end soon, so times are changing. But that doesn't mean I'll leave y'all behind. Yes, I'll be exceptionally busy as I'm traveling on, but that doesn't mean the fun will end. I'll still find ways to make you guys smile from time to time. But until then, this is HendrickFan247, signing off. Oh, hold on now, that wasn't a part of the script. Well, there was no bad meme at all in the video, so I decided to give the people what they wanted. You're welcome, internet.